In traditional networks, you have a handful of apps and services. They're statically deployed and fixed by location. They don't change very much. You set them up, you test connectivity, and you walk away. Today, we see those apps moving to the cloud, which means your users at all locations need network access to those apps. Oh, and then you have home-based users to manage, and they need the same access to those apps. And don't forget about your mobile users. They also need that same access. And then there's IoT, adding even more devices and connections on the network. Wow, you're left with a spider web of network connections to monitor and manage nowadays. And on top of all this, next-gen network technologies like SDN and NFV, software-defined data centers, and SD-WAN are adding even more complexity, making all those connections appear and disappear based on user demand versus fixed communications like in the past. How can you predict network behavior in this chaotic and complex network landscape? The answer is, in this new world of modern networks, active testing has to be done constantly, frequently, and automatically. Anytime, anywhere. When changes occur, demand for new resources is needed, or new services are launched. You need to be able to generate traffic, validate reliability, and then monitor in real time to gain insights into network behavior and its potential impact on the customer experience. Active testing and live network monitoring delivers predictive network behavior through agile deployments that can be provisioned anywhere versus fixed network appliances in specific locations. Automated testing that's tied to when services are launched or changes occur. And application driven. Testing should mimic real world applications like SAP or email or webcasts or even shopping experiences. Predicting network behavior in agile modern network architectures brings a whole new level of assurance to network operations teams who expect SDN technologies to better equip them to compete in the digital age. For more information, download our joint solution brief here.